Hey, good morning, airplanes and coffee. I am out here at Denton Airport, KDTO. Uncle Steve and I just arrived, and I'm still trying to get my, uh, where'd he go? Oh, he's behind me. Just arrived. And uh, I'm actually doing something for these guys. What do you do for airplanes of coffee? You bring them coffee. Because they've been so nice to me, giving me some shirts. Check out the three RVs. That's a four place, two place, and there's an A model, which is the tail drag. Oh, <laughs> there's always lots of familiar and friendly faces out here at Airplanes and Coffee. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the chief executive <laughs> rat, Bill Goble, Hangar Rats. That's Good me. to see you here. You guys made it. You didn't get lost. You know All right, fading in. So I'm inside US Jet Center right now, just kind of walking around. And uh, there's a lot of people here. You know, occasionally you run into uh, somebody, some famous names and faces. There's a table over here with some famous YouTube guys, Brian Turner, Just Plain Silly, and Dan Milliken of Taking Off. And then you have aviation pups. <laughs> oh, aren't you just so sweet? You just so sweet. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> Come on. Thanks for sharing your daughter too. Oh, you are just oh yes you are. You can watch them. What scratchy? I'll send them to the airplane. <laughs> gotta get my gotta get my fill hand out your this butt scratchies. <laughs> Now, unfortunately, all the variety donuts have already been exhausted. But I want to point out they got they got the good creamer and even little containers of cow. That's totally awesome. And over here, everybody knows this famous aviator. So let's say we go out here and we look at some airplanes. And here is the head honcho. You about to go do a discovery flight? We are about to go do a discovery flight. You are going to discover aviation and you're going to love it. It's highly addictive. It's worse than methamphetamine, I'm telling you. <laughs> it even costs more than methamphetamine. It's terrible. I don't know that for a fact, but I just assume. <laughs> don't forget to loudly and obnoxiously clear prop. 
Ready to cry. <laughs> this is my best friend and his son Alex going up right here. I've been hanging out with this dude since fourth grade. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry <for him. laughs> Does he admit that? <laughs> what do you do it under oath? That's a never good start. Wow. All right. So this is 20 Papa. Everybody knows 20 Papa. If you know who flies 20 Zero Papa, give you something, help give you a clue. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's a camera. Put that in the comments below if you know who flies 20 Papa. <gasps> what do we got here? Huh. It's a side shot. What do we got here? Diagonal shot. If I had 18, exactly 18 months to go And if by now you don't recognize red, white, and blue Skylark, then you must not be a subscriber to my channel. Now, <clears throat> on the topic of subscribing, please click the subscribe button. You know, it'd be nice to click the notification bell too and give me a thumbs up occasionally, but. Breaking in here. It wouldn't be the first time we've had a jet that showed up for airplanes and coffee. But, uh. First one of these jets that's ever shown up for airplanes and coffee. Wow, look at this thing. Kind of looks like a little beluga whale. When you have a jet and you realize how cheap Jet A is. See, that's a <laughs> that's the captain of this aircraft. And see the smile on his face. So you're showing up for some coffee and donuts. <laughs> What's that? Oh, my name's Larry. Hi, I'm Jay. Hey. Jay Yurz, the Wolf Pilot. Yes. Beautiful airplane. Thank you. Look at this thing. Wow. Gorgeous. Thanks for bringing it, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Interesting. Is it six, sir? It holds seven, but I've only got four seats in it. There's definitely a weight. Yeah, yeah, when you guys higher up. How's it going? Yeah, that's all. I, uh, I got people. Well, I thought it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
that's part of some shutdown procedure? No, no, I'm sure. Just, oh, just showing off? They're, what they're really doing is they're letting the engine cool off a little bit. Uh, with the cow flaps open before they shut down. Ladies and gentlemen, I bring you Murica. Look at that. Did you do some work for once? Did you do some work for once? I hope you paid extra for the start. <laughs> Hey, is that the oil pump you have running? So is that uh, basically uh, draining out one of the sumps or is that pre-lubing for the next start? Okay. So if you don't do that, all the oil ends up on the ground? I was hoping you'd do another one of those excited noggle moves <laughs> so I can make another gif. <laughs> excited noggle that gif. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. Such a beautiful day. Uh, these bad boys right here. Huh? This <laughs> puts it in perspective. There's more oil on the outside of that engine than there is on the inside of mine. <laughs> Holy crap! This looks, like, this looks like my 540. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! That's so much oil. I'm about to start it. He's got to put two extra boards. My husband too. I think you have me confused for somebody else. <laughs> 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 So folks, when you're a YouTube A-lister, that's what happens. You have random people come up to you saying, hey, my husband's a fan of your channel. That too will probably also go on the thumbnail. But since I'm not even an F-lister, maybe, maybe I'm somewhere like a Z-lister right now until I crest 10,000 subscribers. But you can help me with that by liking, sharing, and subscribing. They are much bigger. Semper Fi. <laughs> Oh, yeah. 
Pleasure. Which horsepower you have on this one? All right, guys. I have one with around 300, and we have one with around 600. Getting this gentleman with now. I'm just the passenger. Congratulations, man. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Aaron, which engine, which horsepower engine you have? I was telling him when I was in Thailand. Okay, so let me grab my cousin. This is what the ties were for. Oh, there they are. We had an airplane at one point that had one tire pipe. Yeah, yeah. We don't have any more. They'd go over there and bomb. Yep. Same airplane. Yeah, I, I was telling him one time that uh, one of them couldn't get it cleared. Yeah. So they they uh, they phoned the runway and he flew around till he was rolling gas and we all sat in our chairs drinking beer watching the TV and this yeah, this, this little little tie about this high he stands up in the seat and waves after he slides to a hall. I hope that doesn't happen. <laughs> oh my gosh, do you have family? Yeah. Hey Steve, I do want to point out right in the center of the of that dash up there is a Garmin G5. <laughs> Gotta have some creature comforts even in an old airplane. <laughs> this is why we come to airplanes and coffee. Well folks, I'm out of here. I'm got Steve next to me and uh we've seen we've met a lot of people and uh had a couple of donuts, a bunch of cups of coffee, it's time to go home. We saw Jets, we saw the Yellow Peril Steerman, we saw T-34, we saw T-28s, we saw Cessna 195s, that's some really old, good stuff. And that jet, uh, that Vision jet, that was, that was cool. That was cool to get to see that, have someone that actually flew that thing in to participate. Anyhow, uh, appreciate you always uh, following me and, and liking, sharing, subscribing and all that stuff. I didn't record the flight up here. I've flown to Denton a bunch of times and so we're not going to bore you to death with that stuff. Anyhow, we'll see you on the next one.